We are ready to go. Is it Sunday we yet? We are. <laughs> All right, here's what's buzzing in Baltimore tonight. A bittersweet celebration at the National mm -hmm. Zoo. As they get ready to say goodbye to, come on now, there we go. There we go. Bay Bay. Bay Bay. We love Bay Bay. Yes. It's your last chance to see Bay Bay, though, before he heads back home to China. This is part of a breeding agreement that all cubs born at the zoo will move to China when they turn four years old. Bay Bay's birthday, of course, was back in August, and he leaves the National Zoo next Tuesday. All right, so still a little time to hang out with Bay Bay, but if you want to have beer, for a dinner. Okay, we, this I'm is listening. What we got. This is called fruit juice, but it's for grown ups. Hail Thor based Heavy Seas Beer is out with its second beer in the Juice Cannon series called Fruit Juice. It's supposed to be like juicier than the flagship beer they offer mm. with notes of fruit punch, pineapple, and citrus. You can taste it later this month at the Heavy Seas Tap Room. Sounds like it's for me. And you know, once I we pull up. I love a good cider, fruity beer. Once we're on the alcohol trail, we just usually we gotta stay. stay. Sticking with the beer theme, how much would you spend on a good brew? $230? I don't think so. A store in the Eastern Shore is selling a bottle of beer for just that, $230. <laughs> and it is so full of alcohol, it's actually illegal in more than a dozen states. Samuel Adams Utopia's 2019 is an American strong ale that comes in a custom ceramic decanter meant to be served mm. one ounce at a time. That'll knock you out. <laughs> That'll <laughs> you put better you to believe bed. it. <laughs>